Good morning, guys. We are doing our first video this morning. Hi, winner. So we have a request to kind of introduce all the foxes. Hi, Eves. So this fox is winner. Also, hash, hashtag Banshee Fox. This girl is very expressive. We, she was one of our first foxes that we got. She is about two years old now. And um, she is our little dominant female. She originally was a fur farm rescue by a rescue up in Minnesota called Save a Fox that many of you guys follow as well. Um, she is bonded with both Franny Fox <laughs> and Senna Fox. And um, she really likes Evie too. That's Evie with my border collie Grace. And she comes out in the fox yard with us quite often. She's really out here not because she loves the foxes, but because she likes to find the treats that the foxes hide. So, <laughs> winner right now is annoying Evie because that's what she does. <laughs> what happened, Eves? Huh? So, Evie is an owner surrender. You'll notice that Evie has one eye because she, when she was quite a small kid at her previous family, she um, tragically was attacked by a dog, not on purpose, but a, just a tragic mistake. Um, the dog got loose out of a room and attacked her. Um, but she, very sweet, she didn't own her surrender, which means somebody had her as a pet and could no longer keep her. So she came here. And um, she's a very sweet girl. She can be persnickety, but she's a sweet girl. Um, can be a little crabby. She likes people better than she likes other foxes. Um, but she can be really pushy with both, which makes her seem a little bit crabby, but she's actually crazy. She's actually a very good little fox and um, we love having her here. She was probably, I think she was our fourth fox that we got in and uh, she's made a place for herself here. She is, I don't think she's really bonded to anybody as far as a best friend um, because she likes people best. Um, she uh, is, she shares an enclosure with um, Senna and they get along really well. It's just, um, I think, <laughs> hi sweet girl, she would prefer the company of people. Yes, wouldn't you girl? Mm -hmm. Her favorite treats are duck turkey wrapped around sweet potato. That's her fave. But she, she will eat just about anything you put in front of her most of the time. Um, and uh, she's a sweet girl. I'm not going to say ages on everybody because honestly, I don't remember all of their ages. Um, so I'll have to go back and look at those. I have to do it anyway because we have to do some, some vet checks. So that's Evie. I think her favorite person is my husband, Jeff. What do you think? You know Winter Fox? We've talked to Winter Fox. So... That's our two highlights. We'll do Senna too, because he's out today. Bam! Senna bam! Senna was named after a famous um, Formula One driver because he is probably our fastest little fox, um, next to Johnny, I think, at this point. Um, he was rescued from the fur farms as a four year old, I believe. Um, that's what we believe. They don't keep really good records and stuff like that. Um, so he was rescued from the fur farms. A lot going on right now. So it's, he's a little nervous. My husband's moving things around with his tractor. So 
gets loud here. Um, but Ben, come here. So we call him Santa, Santa Banna. Ben he gets all kinds of nicknames. But he was in the fur farms probably for about four years as a breeder, we believe. His color is lavender. His eyes are bright, light, bright blue. And um, he's a very sweet guy for being in the fur farms for as long as he was. He can be a little spooky. He has some issues with his sight because of genetics and the color of his eyes being so light. He has a hard time seeing in bright sunlight. Um, but he's a really good guy. He has never bitten anybody. He's just very kind when he takes food, when he um, is around people. So, and he's bonded with Winter. He loves Winter. And he also loves a fox we have named Franny. And he kind of likes Evie. He spends his, he spends his enclosure time with Evie. Um, not because they're best friends, but because they get along really well. Um, and Winter spends her time with Johnny now. So, I know. I know you're done with this and you want to go out now because you haven't found any trees. But we're doing something here. You're going to have to wait. So, that's Santa. So, that's the first three we got. Also, Franny Fox is another fox that we got at the same time. So, we will talk about her at a later date. But, um, right now... It's these two. And if you're wondering why the foxes get along with dogs, because these guys were both raised around dogs. <coughs> so they um, easily get along with dogs. Foxes that aren't, aren't always kind to dogs. They will bite. And it's not always something that is automatic, that they, if you raise them with a dog, they'll like dogs. That's not tr the truth. They may or they may not. You may end up with a big issue with that. Um, so we have, I mean, we have foxes that we raise in six weeks old who don't like dogs, some that do, and then some that absolutely despise cats, some like cats. So it's, it's, um, it's a toss up as to whether or not they'll like them or not. So that's what we got guys. All right. We will talk to you soon. Namaste.